Okay, hello. Uh, excuse the mess. Uh, moved all my stuff in my room. You know, four years worth of stuff. Uh, took a lot of moving, and I had to do it in a hurry because they kind of kicked us out of the dorms really fast. So, a lot of stress over that. Plus, everything moving online, you know. Been working on that. So, this is my, uh, my video for Project 3 of everything I did. So, these are all the studies I did. Is uh, hatching I did. This is wet on wet cross hatch. See right there, it's kind of blue, blue and black. That's cool. Scumming black, dark blue on blue. And some of that. Stippling, black and blue. I like the color. Dry brush. Lots of scuffing. And the uh, flat wash and the blending with blue and black. I actually like how this one blended and came together. Now for the two paintings. For this one see here is the representational uh, it's the lakeside you see there's a tree right there there's a dead tree right there some you know seaweed or stuff in the lake it was a cloudy day so I got some of the clouds and the reflection kind of the same as the sky got the reflections of the trees and I used the, f the flat uh, wash blending for like the sky and I use some scumming for the trees, as you can see there. Did some dry brush for the leaves and the grass. And a little bit of stippling, a little bit of more stippling for the, uh, for like the trees, just to get a little more brown in there. All, the te all those techniques I use. A little bit of cross hatching for the water, just to get a little more, like not so much the sky. Yeah, that's what I did. This is the one where it's the you have to put it on wet. And you know, this one's a little different. The dead tree is a little less intricate because you know it's kind of rough to put it on still sopping wet. And the sidewalk, you know, that's a little different too. Also, I had to put it on wet, also, I had to do everything real fast, so every mistake I made, I had to correct. So that's why the sidewalk's different, the dead branches, the trees leaning to the side instead of just being a regular tree. Grass overall came up the same, and as you can see, the trees kind of didn't aren't as long and don't reflect a lot in the water. Because it was still wet and kind of tough to do. But yeah, as you can see, the sky is like a different color, like Lion King-esque sunset. Yeah, those are my two paintings. Thank you for watching my video. Also, forgot to mention the techniques I used. I used a flat wash blending for the sky, as you can see there. Use the dry brush for the grass and use the scumming, uh, mainly for a little bit of the branches on each of the things. So it's all wet. And I don't know if you can see, but you can see kind of see some of the background. I use a little bit of scumming, kind of match it. Definitely use some cross hatching for the water, as you can tell by the sporadic things. Got a little bit of reflection there, but yeah, that those are the techniques for the second painting. Thank you.